Hi Gemini, this is your girl Aqua Goddess coming with your bonus read. Keep in mind that this reading will be for past, present, future and it may or may not resonate with you. If you're interested in getting a personal reading, donating to the channel, purchasing any artwork or manifestation jewelry, the information will be in the description box below. Also guys, keep in mind that our other channel is open, so make sure you guys check out the community tab to follow the link to the new page. Make sure that you like and subscribe to both channels. It would be gladly appreciated and also help you get your notifications for your future readings. I've already prayed and meditated over your energy, so we're just going to go ahead and tap right in. Spirit angels, ancestors, guides, please protect me while channeling the messages for the sign of Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Note. Please return all negative energy back to sender to million fold. And anybody out there showing me love, much love and light to you. Angel number 101. Spirit, what are the messages, the general messages for Gemini's bonus read? Celebrating and not caring for losers. So a lot of you guys may be accomplishing some things right now or overcoming some things right now. Whatever the case may be, I definitely see that you're getting out, having a good time. You're not focused on other people's feelings at this time. Not in a selfish way, but more in a self-love kind of way. You're more focused on yourself and making yourself happy. You realize that you put a lot of energy and time into people, places, and things that did not reciprocate equal give and take. And so I see that you're just having a good time, focusing on yourself, your own emotional balance, and your own, you know, spiritual balance and things of that sort. Oh, some of you all are experiencing marriage marriage issues, angel number 222. Or um, this could be a situation where you're in a commitment and it's just not going well. Things are being shaky, having a hard time seeing eye to eye, you know, can't communicate. I'm seeing that there could be a masculine energy that's drinking a lot, getting out a lot, and not really concerned about home. Um, they could just not be discussing or addressing things that needs to be addressed. Yeah, I definitely feel like you guys are kind of detached at this time if you are in a relationship. And if there's no contact, you guys are kind of easing into healing. And I see that you're rising. So there's a lot going on, a lot of things that you've been wanting to get done. Um, you're not wasting time. You are focused more on what it is that you need to do and just balancing your chakras out. You know what I'm saying? Like making sure that you're getting everything that you need to get done. There's somebody that's up in your business on your page here. Um, they're looking you up, trying to find out more information about you or what you currently have going on. This could be someone at your job or someone that puts you in a third party situation here. Yeah, you are unfazed because things are really working out in your favor. In your last reading, you got the Wheel of Fortune card. So I know that you are destined to be in a great space. Things are turning right now. Very un unexpected changes for you in a good way. Oh, I see a detach here because somebody got caught red-handed. They were lying, cheating, stealing, manipulating. Something that got exposed. And I see that just shifted your energy to where you're looking at this from a very logical perspective. And you're like, you know what? This is the same shit, different day. Same spirit, different person. Same shit I'm not about to deal with. Yeah. Yep. Block. Yeah, so you could have blocked this person. If you did not literally block them, you definitely blocked them out of your energy and started focusing more on your bag, okay? And I'm not even mad at you because you should have. That motherfucker was tripping, period, point blank. I see love triangle, uh, love triangle confirmation here. 
somebody thought because they ain't have no pictures or something that they thought that they deleted everything or some shit and they didn't. Yeah, I see that you guys are hustling right now. You get into some money. Block out any distractions at your job or whatever it is that you're doing, even if you're an entrepreneur. Don't let people affect you because I see that somebody is trying to get under your skin. Shady ass. You're like, you guys could also have a boss that's doing something that they should not be fucking doing. This person is going to be fucking reported for being shady. Yep. So don't even worry about it. Oh, wow. <laughs> Thank you, Spirit. That's a compliment right here. Okay. So you have Bogus Hiller in reverse. And it landed right on top of Caught Red Handed and Reported to Human Resources. So Spirit is saying that whomever your Hiller is that you go to for your insight, they definitely spoke some truth to you about this person. And about your job situation. So yeah, th these people are caught and exposed red-handed. Because you know I'm going to keep it all the way G with you in this motherfucker. So yeah, it's somebody at your job that's shady as hell. They doing something they're not supposed to be doing. A lot of them could be stealing money. If you guys handle money. Or doing some type of account transfers or some shit I'm hearing. Yeah, they're going to be exposed. And then whoever this lover is, they didn't got exposed doing some shit too. Yeah, judgmental. This see, this person's these energies are being judged because I see that you are not bothering anybody. You are minding your own fucking business, taking care of your own shit, and you know people are out to get you, or not even so much in a victimized state, but more like you not fucking with people, and people are fucking annoying you, doing shit to try to get over on you, trying to manipulate you. Like, all this weird-ass energy when they can just mind their own business, too. Like, what the fuck? Yeah, catfish energy. So, it's just a lot of fake-ass people. So, it's going to be a lot of fake-ass support if you got a lot of good things going on right now. There's a lot of people that are experiencing misfortunes, and they are definitely talking shit about you. Even if they act like they're not and they act like they support you. So be, be very cautious of your energy and how you feel around people. How do people make you feel? How does their energy make you feel? Pay attention. Pay close attention. All right. Because spirit is telling you that if you got a feeling about somebody, you not fucking crazy. You not. You got plenty of fucking sense and you know when some shit is off. Okay. Yeah, line up ladies. So, yeah, somebody could be a masculine energy that's just not very, very faithful. They shady as hell. They're going to be exposed by some healer. It could be me or who knows. But they're going to be exposed. Gemini. Yeah, somebody, somebody is saying that you're catfished. They're judging you from afar. And it's because you're unfazed. So this person thinks that you fake. When no, it's not that you didn't have feelings for them. But it's just like, I'm not about to fucking play with you. Like, I'm not a child. Like, and that's the energy that you got going on. So they feel like you switched up on them. But, um, gossip talk at work. I told you, somebody at your job is judging you or paying attention to you. And it could be a boss. They shady ass going to get exposed for doing something that they're not supposed to be doing. Somebody could also be gossiping about if you are dating a employee or a manager. Could be a cancer that's talking about you or that you're... Yeah, this is a cancer. The spirit says, you ain't tell no lies, baby. Go ahead. <laughs> baby bump. Oh, shit. Um, what is this spirit? Come over. Oh, I don't know if this already happened or if this is future. But there's somebody that might want to come over. Somebody going to get pregnant that night. But they already involved with... No, like, this shit is messy. Okay. 
somebody might contact you and ask you if they can come over or they may ask you if you can come over it could be a cancer or a gemini it could be anybody um this person wants to speak some kind of truth to you with the hopes of you guys fucking crying it out together i don't fucking know what the fuck this is but crying it out together some shit i don't know but i know it's ending in pregnancy so please be careful if this is not something that you want okay yep it says miracle creation star seed seer yep so <clears throat> there could be a baby that's born and this baby is going to be a star seed there's a miracle creation so this could be a situation where you didn't know you can have kids or maybe this person didn't think they can still have kids maybe you guys are older i don't know but just be careful because somebody gonna get pregnant for sure turn down the invite oh my gosh y'all i cannot make this shit up it says turn down the invite lack of trust so somebody might purposely try to get you pregnant okay or you might get somebody or somebody might purposely try to trap you if you're masculine energy also there's an invite that's going to happen through your job somebody you work with is going to um invite you out somewhere do not fuck with these people man they do not have your best interest fuck around try to get you fired or some dumb shit like don't fuck with these people moon magic see i told you turn the invite down there's a lack of trust all right so those are the, the those are the messages that i have for your bonus read gemini um if you guys need anything from me or if you uh have any questions or anything make sure you tap in also leave me a comment in the uh comment section let me know how you guys felt about our aqua goddess mermaid section uh that we did yesterday I definitely want to know how you feel about the combined signs. All right. But I definitely appreciate all of the love and support. And I will talk to you soon. Make sure you have a great day. Peace.